don't diva. Frugal diva. Frugal diva. What, what? Frugal diva. Southern Charities Bakery. Southern Charities Bakery. Yes, Dawns and Divas, we are here today with another exciting video. Yes. So today, we have finally have a loot crate box. Finally! Finally, it has happened to me right in front of my... Yeah. Finally. Finally! We have a loot crate box. This box, I believe, was supposed to have been given ever since April. So, um, we're going to see what's in it. It is, I believe it's the sci-fi box. I think this one was since April. Or either since, uh, or maybe it might be a little bit uh, later. Maybe this was the September one. And I still didn't get the April box. I don't even, I, I just I just don't know about Loot Crate. I don't know. But before we get into that, I have another box. Because this is going to be a double unboxing. Yeah. So, so now let's get on into this uh, Loot Crate box. Okay. Not too thrilled because it took forever and 10,000 days to get here. But it's okay. So this is the Loot Crate box. This is the sci-fi box says sci-fi on it. We're going to open up this box. And I am going to be very impartial. Even though it's a feather in a day to get here, I'm going to be very impartial. So, first thing I see on the top is a shirt, t-shirt. And I've never gotten a t-shirt from Loot Crate. In all the boxes that I've gotten, I'll, I, besides this box, I've got Besides this box, I've gotten three other boxes, and I don't think I ever got a t-shirt. I can't say I've never gotten a wearable, but I've never gotten a t-shirt because I got an apron one time, and I really liked that apron. It was Deadpool. Really liked it. So in any case, this is the t-shirt. It says Lost in Space, which would be fitting because this is a sci-fi box. So the t-shirt is very plain. And I like that. I like that it's very plain. So it's definitely a t-shirt I would definitely wear. Because it's very plain. It's not, like if I wear a t-shirt, I like a kind of plain t-shirt. I don't like stuff all too busy all over the place and stuff like that. Because, no, I'm just not into that. And then on the side, the same piece that's on the front is on the side. The little diamond, whatever. I guess maybe that's the logo for Lost in Space. I don't know. Because it's here on the front too. But I definitely am going to wear this t-shirt. And it is it is a size large. So that's the t-shirt. Next. I mean, I want... <laughs> okay, this is... It says shield eyes from light. Shield eyes from light. And I think it's some sort of bag. Let's open it up. Let's open it up. Because I want to be very unhappy. Because it's a little fat that they took 10,000 years. But anyway, we open it up. This is how the bag looks. And it zips around. I guess, oh no. It feels like something's in it. I don't know. What the heck. A little tote bag. Oh, okay. Okay, so you got to turn that over like that. And then open it up like this. So, and then that becomes a pocket. You know what? It's a little car on the side. I don't know what this is from. I'm guessing it's from something, but whatever. This is nice. This is nice. This is. Nice. Let me tell y'all something. Now I don't. <laughs> oh God! But this, this this is good. Let me tell you why this is good. Now I personally don't use this. Ear, this airline, but um, I'm gonna tell you the two airlines. I, I have okay, let me be truthful. I've flown on this, this air, the first airline that I'm gonna say I've flown on it one time and one time only. And I will, I never say never, but I'm hoping never to have to fly them again. And that would be Spirit Airlines. I'm not trying to go against Spirit Airlines, but you know, you get what you pay for. And then there's another one that people told me about, which is called Frontier, which is in the same avenue as Spirit Airlines. But the reason why I'm bringing them up is because of this bag. 
let me tell y'all something. This bag right here, if I was a frequent Spirit Airlines traveler, which I am not, I travel JetBlue, and I love JetBlue, have a JetBlue card. I'm, I'm a JetBlue person. I love me some JetBlue. But in any case, so, and of course, this is not sponsored by Jet, JetBlue, even though I wish it was, but it's not. But in any case, let me tell you a little something about this bag and spirit. This bag would be an excellent bag to have if you are a frequent traveler of Spirit Airlines. Because when I tell you they don't give you a bag big enough to do nothing, the size of the bag that they allow on their airline ain't big enough to do nothing with. And being that this bag is very easily to collapsible, you can kind of, you can put, you can stuff this bag and then you can stuff it down in that little uh, thing that they use to say whether they're going to allow this bag to be free or not. Because <laughs> you only get one personal item. One, you only get one carry-on. Whether it's a person, whether it's a, a, a pocketbook or whatever, you only get one. And after that, you got to pay on Spirit Airlines. So please know that. Before you frequent Spirit, Spirit and Frontier Travelers, y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. But this would be an excellent bag for that. And even if I, even though I don't travel uh, Frontier or Spirit, and I want to be very angry with Loot Crate for taking 10 years to think, I actually really, really like this bag. So, I like the t-shirt and I like the bag, so I... Loot Crate, you really pulled it out. You pulled it out of your behind with this one because I really, really like this bag. And I really, really like the t-shirt. So you're lucky, Loot Crate. You're really, really lucky. Next thing I want to show is a pin. And let me tell you, I love pins. I love pins. And Loot Crate always gives you a pin in each and every box. I've gotten a pin in each and every box I've ever gotten from them. And this is no exception. I really like this pin. It says Lost in Space. And... This is the pen. Let me take it out of here so we get the glare off. But yeah, I like the pen because I love pens. I love pens. I love, 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 love pens. So there is the pen. There it is in all its glory. And I and I really like this pen because I love pens. I just love pens. I love, love, love pens. I'm a pen, pen person. Now. I have, I love pins so much, I have started a pin subscription box. It's a patch and pin box, which is going to be linked in the description box below. Next, oh, another thing I love, postcards. I love postcards. These are postcards. And I love postcards. And I, oh, yes. Okay, Loot Crate, y'all getting me. Y'all getting me. Y'all pulling it out of y'all behind. Loot Crate, y'all pulling it out of y'all behind. Okay, sorry, guys. Sorry for putting the knife towards y'all. Wasn't trying to threaten anyone. Was not trying to threaten anyone. No one was I trying to threaten. No, no one. But let's open that up. And I love, love, love postcards. Definitely. Love, love, love postcards. If y'all want to send me some postcards, it would be greatly appreciated. Because I love postcards. Postcards from anywhere. And my, um, my, um, Mailing address, which is my business address, is always in the description box below. So if you feel free, feel free to send me some postcards or some call postcards. Of course, I'm a writer. I'm an avid writer. I'm an avid reader. I love to read, so that's why I love postcards. Oh my gosh! Send me a postcard. Put a little put a little story on it about yourself. Something, anything. I love it, and I will sure enough show it on here if that's what you want me to do. But this is really really nice postcards that I will definitely be either keeping for myself or sending off. Most likely I'll be sending some of them off. Because like I said, I love postcards. I love postcards! Did I say I love postcards? Did I say I love postcards? I love postcards. Okay. I said it. I love postcards. Yeah, baby. Fly me to Mars. Speaking of, speaking of Mars, Mars, my name is going to Mars next year. Because I put my name in the NASA thing, and it's gonna be going to Mars on a little, uh, on a little um, piece of the spaceship that is going to Mars. I think either it's either next year or 2021. I'm not exactly sure, but I'm going to Mars, guys. I'm going to Mars. Well, at least my name is. <laughs> yeah, babe. 
baby. Yeah, baby. And Venus. Venus to Milo. Venus. Yeah, baby. Like I said, I love me some postcards. I love, I love, I love me some postcards. So, last but not least in the box, we have... Warning! Do not touch things. Okay. Because it's electric. It's electric. Boogie, wiggy, wiggy. <laughs> okay, so this is it. It says Jurassic Park. Okay. I don't know exactly what this is. It's kind of hard. Let's open it up so we can get a better look at what the heck this is. Because I'm trying to read the back and I don't see. It must be worn at all times. Include shoes and shirts. I don't know. Don't give me the line on what this is. Don't get me the lion. It feels like like a uh, I don't know what it feel like. It feel like a something. Oh, okay. Whatever it is, you can put. Oh, you can put this on the fence because it has the uh, little things to put on your fence. Okay. Right. 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 Well, I can't use this right now. Because I live in an apartment style dwelling. So I can't use this right now. But when my husband and I move to our house in the south, definitely we'll have this for the fence. Yeah. Yeah. We'll have this. We'll have it for the fence, guys. Yeah. So I like this. I like this. It says Jurassic World. And it says, has a little, uh, dinosaur, you know, as if we, uh, you know, the facilities, the, the facilities, the science facilities, or whatever the case may be, but yeah, I like it, I like it. Let me tell y'all something, as long as it took for this daggone little crate box to come, I want to be very, very angry, but I'm absolutely not angry at all, because I really like everything that was inside of the box. So, Loot Crate, like again, like I said again, you pulled it out of your behind. You pulled it out of your behind. So, in any case, Dawn's the Deepest. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to send me some postcards or cards, you know, hey, if they will be greatly appreciated from wherever you are in the world watching this video, definitely in the description box below will be the address where you can send postcards and cards and i love to read i love to get mail i love i love to read i'm an avid reader really not a movie person i will go to the movies but i am an avid reader i love 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 to read that's why i love postcards i love writing i love all of that kind of good stuff i'm just built nerdy like that and if y'all didn't know which um y'all may not know because only my um my, only my family, which when I say family, I mean people that are subscribed to the page, uh, I mean to the channel, who are part of my couponing community, where I do coup where I do couponing, which I haven't done a couponing video in a while. But um, those people, they know that I am an adjunct professor. Yes, they know I'm an adjunct professor, so I am a nerd. I am a nerd. Nerd, guys. I am a nerd. That's why I have my glasses. My nerd glasses. I'm a nerd. So, like I said, in any case, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. If you are subscribed, make for your notification bell. Just turn it on. And once again, if you, yeah, just kind of dry begging. I am. I'm dry begging right now. But if you want to send me some postcards or some cards, yeah, okay. Description In the description box below. Description box below, Frugal Diva, and stay off the property before you get electrocuted. See ya.